streak, and I just picked up this Rain 6, and God's helping me test it out today. Um, this is a 72-pound bow on the performance setting. It's rated at an IBO 350, and uh, I want to see what Scott thinks about it. Uh, I've only had the, option, the opportunity to throw two, three arrows through it. Uh, you know it's on the performance setting. It's a little bit stouter draw cycle, um, as I'm sure most of the guys that shoot bow techs are aware when you start going to the comfort level or the comfort setting. It's a whole different bow. Um, but, of course, you lose a little bit of speed with that. Mm -hmm. So we were just going to mess around with it today and see what kind of speeds we're getting out of the performance setting. Um, from what we've shot so far, it's quite impressive. Uh, you guys are in the background trying to get me to laugh while we're on video here. But uh, anyways, nice bow. Botex put out quality bows for a lot of years. Um, this, of course, is coming from a Matthews guy. So yeah. anyhow, let's uh, see what kind of speeds we're putting out on. Real nice looking riser on it. It's better with you than with us. I agree. Bob would have left and I've been by myself and yeah. then I got nothing done. Then he said he was over here and got caught. We got 3.30 on that one. <laughs> Do another one here. I can hold it sure. Right. Yeah, this is a 72-pound bow, 29 inches. <clears throat> and we're thinking around 3.80 on the arrow. We'll, we'll go measure it in a little bit. 3.70, 3.80, so. Pretty smooth, it looks like. Just a short valley. Mm -hmm. Or dwell in the valley, I mean. We had 3.30 again, 0.6. We've seen as high as 3.33 and probably as low as 3.28, but pretty consistent those last two shots. Yeah, it's so. smoking fast. That's unbelievable. Yeah. Pretty, not bad. Yeah. But, you know, a little bit of vibe, but when you get a stabilizer on it, you're not going to notice yeah. anything. Yeah. Quiet. Yeah. Yep. So. Yeah, pretty good bow. Well, thank you, Scott. Yeah, no problem.